YouTube has been flooded with videos over the years of how to make custom thumbnails and the best apps to make them on. Yes, I know I'm not a pro YouTuber, but do I want to be? Yes, I do. Just give me a second, YouTube, real quick, and we can get to this video. So yeah, there's this one app in particular I wanted to talk about today that you guys probably either don't know or just don't care about in general, even if you do know. This app is one of my favorites and probably the one that I have for a long time. It has 3.6 stars. You probably already know what it is from the title maybe and pictures from this video. It is one, the only, thumbnail maker. That's right, this app. You can make thumbnails, like it's obvious, kid. Don't even remind me about that. It's a joke. Um, yeah, you can make thumbnails. You can do channel art. That's what it was called, not cover art. Or that earlier. <laughs> you can, uh, you can make pretty much anything. You have your cover, as I'm, I'm kind of not really used to the fact that I'm talking about covers right now. So, unless you count music, then yes. And also, you can see your projects as well. I really like this app, but the thing is, after I make my thumbnails, you have to go to YouTube Studio, at least for me anyway, and you have to use them. You have to put them in your thumb, and you have to put them in your video, like, so flippin' weird. Come on, YouTube, get your stuff together. I don't want to have to do it in that. I just want to do it how I used to do it. Did the app get an update or something I don't know about? 3.6 stars, which I thought I mentioned, but whatever, I'll say it again regardless. I really adore this app. Even though it has like, not even 4 stars. I really appreciate this app. And it has decent reviews, like blah 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 blah. Um, so yeah guys. Yeah, I've made some decent thumbnails on there. And I would love to make one on this too, so. That would be awesome, and uh, you can also search up thumbnails as well. It's pretty cool. You can search them up, and uh, I really have a lot of, I mean, I not a lot, I, I have two, but I, technically three because one of them got copied it was the one on how to gain 2,000 subscribers I mean it's not even 2,000 it's not supposed to be 2,000 what the heck but anyway yeah you guys I have uh three thumbnails that 2,000 subscriber one or whatever the heck you want to call that video how to gain subscribers me for some reason because my my side of my my side of my personalities don't know any better but to just copy it so yeah, guys, and then another one is just a test one for a video that I tried to do on my phone, but then the storage was running out on both of them, so I had to delete my YouTube app. But anyway, guys, yeah, I really like this app. You, you, you can, I mean, I try to avoid copyright on this app, honestly, because I don't really like copyright at all. So, yeah, guys, I think that's just gonna about wrap it up, so. But I did want to tell you one more thing on how to get this thumbnail onto the YouTube Studio if you haven't already figured it out how to get your thumbnails onto your videos through real quick. So, what you want to do is you want to go first. You want to go to YouTube Studio, right? And you want to go to one of your videos that you've posted where you just don't have a thumbnail on in general. You want to click on that video. And then you want to go to Custom Thumbnail. You want to edit your thumbnail and then go to Custom on the top of all your thumbnails on the right. They'll be small, don't worry, they're small custom of course and then you wanna then you have your photos and you can go to moments or wherever you the heck you have them your thumbnail in I just usually go to moments because yeah I want to um so you go to moments you can do that save and I forgot if there's anything else before that but yeah guys I really like this but I don't like the YouTube studio part but you know what for the heck of it we don't care at all and I don't care but it's not necessarily copyright anywho so hey anyway, guys I'll see you guys next time Goodbye, peeps.